Hey, what's up guys? As you can see, I'm in a familiar uh, scenario. Over here, I'm a uh, crepe custom, once again. Go figures. Feel like home over here. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm going here with my good friend Tim. Uh, I don't know if you guys saw him before in the video, but it's, uh, there, um, he's in charge of the public relation of crepe custom, and also, of course, work with the shop. Um, <coughs> he, today, he's gonna show you mostly, because I don't know that much about it, the new AC-18. We have two different versions, the full stock and the regular one. Um, like I said, I don't know too much about it. I saw that you guys did already on Instagram and so forth. Um, but I read to um, him to go through the gun and tell you a little bit about them. So without any further waste of time, well, Tim, why don't you go ahead and introduce the two guns to us. Thank you. All right. So we have the AC-18 here. Uh, on this one specifically, we've got the Liberty Suppressors A Chaotic um, on our IMS. We have another gun over to the side here. Uh, it's got the titanium muzzle brake. Grab that. Both are really simple to take off. On the muzzle brake, all you have to do is pull on the detent, spin it, comes right off. On the Liberty Suppressor, custom made for the IMS, all you have to do is spin it and pop it off and works nice and simple. Each gun will come with the uh, bird cage and then uh, the IMS is pinned and weld to the barrel. Uh, there we go, we got our 16 inches right there. Um, a little bit more about the gun. We have finally switched over to M-Lock, the AC-18. Um, the handguard is made out of aluminum and black anodized. Uh, these will go onto a AC-15. Um, we'll be selling them shortly. Uh, what receiver do you guys use? Hmm? Which receiver do you guys use? We use both the Childers and uh, Morrissey. Okay. Um, we kind of go in and out. Some batches will have more C, some will be childers. It just depends on what we have. Um, each gun is painted with our Krebs coat. It's very durable. I mean, it takes a little bit to get a little scratch on there. Um, just like any gun though, you will get wear inside, mm -hmm. especially where the uh, bolt carrier is traveling and whatnot. Um, Speaking of the bolt carrier, each hammer and trigger and bolt carrier are all very fine tuned. The triggers are now fit to each gun, um, so they're specifically polished down and everything for the guns themselves. Um, we've got our typical Krebs Custom Scope Rail. Uh, these will be the last, um, well not the last, but Soon we will be uh, kind of discontinuing this model, um, so we won't be seeing these scope mounts anymore. Um, and then also we'll be changing up the gas tube, uh, hopefully. Uh, anything else? No, the crab, of course you got your guys. We, we got safety. our safety. The, the trigger is an LG, LG of course. We didn't, yep, we didn't ALG. Um, one thing I noticed that you guys going to start using now from now on, you start already the KV, um, Mod 2, yep. um, the extended mag yeah, release. Yeah, the extended mag release. That's going to be a standard issue pretty much now. Yep. A really fan, big fan of it. And and um, mag pool for neutral, of course. Mm -hmm. um, the kit and the barrel, were, sorry, the, the parts are Polish parts, right? Yes, the parts are Polish parts. Um, WBP. Okay. Uh, they're all brand new. We get them shipped over here. Uh, the hammer, or sorry, the barrel is hammer forged chrome line, which is very nice. And there's also from uh, Poland? I believe the barrel is US made. Okay. Um, the gas blocks were, or sorry, not the gas blocks, the gas tubes, uh, we're kind of doing our own little manufacturing process okay. to them. So that um, one, yeah, okay. Yep. And uh, like I said, it's it's very similar. That's one thing I noticed. I, I thought it was very similar to the, yeah, it's a mix between the AC and yep. the KV. I mean, it's, a, it's more like a, but I, I really like it. So you were saying that there won't be a long run for this, right? Yeah, it's not going to be a uh, typical long run. We're going to get uh, 
maybe about a hundred more or so. Okay, got gotcha. And then uh, we'll be discontinuing them and changing to a different model. Of well, what's the what's the retail price for the full size and, and then the folding? On the uh, typical AC18, the retail price is 1940. On the folding stock version, it's going to be about $125 more. These should be up on the website uh, within the week or so. The folding stock, uh, the knuckle itself is made by CNC Warrior. Um, we've kind of had them made specifically for our guns. They're not proprietary, but what we ordered them. <laughs> We specifically order them for us, um, and they work very nice. There's no button; all you do is push down, and it releases really right away. And then to slap it back in place, it's nice and simple; just fits right there. Yeah, one thing I noticed that compared to my KB, which I love, by the way, is the weight. I mean, indeed, I mean, it's one of the, the cons about the K, my KB. It's the weight. I'm mean, might getting a little hold, maybe, but <laughs> but. The, you you get it, it's it's but you know you have to say also the KV the KV receiver the thicker receiver yep. the barrels and I mean it's an uh, well in the KV it's based off the RPK okay so yeah so these are based off the AKM that's it um it's it's about a pound lighter and yeah. you really know that you really notice the difference oh, yeah. when you're holding it um, which is nice other than that I'm um, honestly you you all know um, of course all the guns are loaded before anybody freaks out over there but <laughs> <laughs> all the crack guns are like butter, you know what I mean? The trigger is tuned in. Like it's, the LG trigger is already a good trigger, yeah, but you guys put trigger. you put a lot. Of, I mean, it's like it's like amazing. I mean, it's so smooth. I mean, and the sights are so easy. Even if you are not an AK guy, um, and we did that actually during AK class with um, with Mark and all the guys and our good friend Tom. And God bless him. But. Um, we did do a class and, and with these sites, even if somebody's not normally, you know, a K guy, so you more like an AR guy, so yep. it's, it makes it easier to adjust them and everything. And we're having some amazing results. I was shooting actually, I think I was, was shooting a KV-13 7.62 during the class, and we were eating a plates at 300, 400 yards yep. like easily. And uh, and it's a mix of everything, you know, the fact that everybody says AK is not accurate or whatever, I'm like, well, you never shoot, <laughs> you never shoot one of the Mark guns or some of the big names, because that's every time I'm I'm amazed, you know, and, and, and honestly, guys, you, you get what you pay for. I mean, there's a lot yeah. of work behind it. I mean, there's no sharp edges, which I cut myself on my old AKs just for, you know, removing a magazine. One of my friends was noticing that this one, is ne ne there's no sharp edge in the mag well anywhere, even the charging end, you know. Yeah, the charging end is smooth. Anywhere. The safety is amazing, good feature. Well, you guys know that already because you know Crab Custom. One of the cool features is, with the safety you can engage the bolt so if you go to range um, some range is required actually that um, you can show the chamber to your uh, range officer and, and make it a gun safe which is a good thing or you can just slap a magazine in an emergency case if you really need it you're good to go I mean it's really cool feature and, and I know I don't want to digress too much but I know Mark products since I moved over here pretty much 2012 and and every single one of my guns has Mark safety well I sold most of mine, but <laughs> most of them. And, uh, and uh, the PIP sites is another great product. The stock adapter is a really, really, if you guys are in 2AKs, you should check them out. You sell it on the website, right? Yep, the stock adapter. The website. I'm a big fan, really solid. Um, they make really good stuff. They, you guys have a few, not a lot of products, by the way, but it's whatever you guys make and put your name on it. We put some time into it. Correct. Make sure it works. It's like, uh, there's a bunch of, unfortunately, AK product and not only on the website, on the internet, that junk you know but this one is i mean everything i put my my money on yep and um like i said that's it um that was a quick overview of the ac18 and then just one more thing sure um you mentioned there's it's all smooth yeah we do tumble the receivers okay. and barrels um well barrel action uh for about three hours and then same thing with all of the parts we're tumbling them getting all those edges off wow. so you really don't run any risk of um, cutting yourself or getting a sag on something. Yeah, I mean, it's something people don't pay attention, but you know what, if you, if you pay in the amount, you know, uh, it's nice you guys put it on it. I know this mm. company that makes it and they don't pay that much attention to those particulars. Um, 
Guns also come with a nice case. You have a cleaning kit, Otis yep. cleaning kit, right? Yeah, the Otis cleaning, cleaning kit. kit. Uh, some extra goodies in there. Mag. Um, yep, mag, Bulgarian mag. Um, the goodies actually, we added it up with the case as well. Um, it's about two hundred dollars worth, oh, like a little extra stuff wow. in there, um, which is pretty cool. Um, I know a lot of other companies don't really. Yeah, it's not something because it's a cleaning yeah. product and then cleaning yep, parts exactly. is like a personal thing, so you don't want to. But yep. I mean, it's it's a cool thing, you know. The oldest kit is, is not a cheap kit, and, and it works, it's you know. Not. If you're if, unless you're old school like me, but um, I like it. it's a nice thing, you know. Also, um, sales wise, you know, have a nice packaging when you're selling a yep. product, and you guys are doing amazing. You're doing an amazing job, as you guys always did, as far. Um, uh, media, you know, public relations media, because it's important thing, you know, that's 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 one of the top sales for, for a gun company, if you ask me. Yeah. Uh, and you've been very supportive, and that's a surprise at the end of the video. <laughs> They're gonna let me land land one of the what this particular AC yep. AC AC18 without without a unfortunately without the can. Yep. Yeah, unfortunately I can't do that. Can we gotta keep here? Yeah. But you know, I pre really appreciate that. We're gonna shoot it together probably. I would love to actually go shooting with them because it's uh, it's cool, you know. I like you guys. We've, we've been friends for a while, and Mark will always be nice with me. I, I do my best, you know. I'm not a big channel, so but, but you know, I think it's um, I like the pro your product like you guys, and it's very you know fine, knowledgeable, you know, and, and everything else like that. But that being said, I don't want to waste your time, team time, your time. You see that little button over there? If you want to like the video, please do it. If you want to subscribe, I appreciate it. Don't forget to click on the bell on the right side, otherwise you won't see my video coming up. As always, thank you very much, team. Thank no you very much to Crab. Mark is not here. Thank you very much to Mark. I'll see you soon. Stay safe and see you next time. Bye-bye.